celebrity capital of the world, it's Hollywood Square, starring Eric Roberts, Harry Gar, Martin Mull, Diane Hedden, our classic comedy square, Norm Crosby, Jeffrey Tambor, Aisha Tyler, Lindsay Wagner, Center Square, Howie How about giving it up once again for his baldness, our center square all this week, Howie Bandow. Pleasure to have you here, Howie. Thank you. And how about our champion yesterday, new car owner, Luisa Abernathy, with $24,340 in cash and stuff. Welcome Thank you. back. Thank you. Well, that was a good start to your championship <laughs> run. You are challenged, though, by the man who hopes to stop it right here, Luisa. Darren Cantrell, welcome, Darren. Thank you, Tom. Good to have you here. Just for clarification, are you the are you the first Darren or the second Darren? I am the first Darren. First Darren. All yes. right. It's tic tac toe. Uh, you know that much. You have to decide if the answers the stars are giving are correct or they're just making them up. That's how you get the squares. First game is a thousand dollar game, and Darren, as the challenger, you get to start it. Howie Mandel, please. Howie is at the MGM Grand in Las Vegas, December second through the sixth. Yes. This week, actually. This week, you're here, then you run there, you then come back. Then at night, I'm there, and then uh, yes, crazy. That's, it is nuts. Beethoven, you know, didn't lose this until he was in his late 40s, Howie. What, what did he lose? Uh, you know, people don't... I think he lost his piano, and then... <laughs> he, no, it's not funny, because he, then he had to play with his organ. Uh, hey! They're not all gems. <laughs> I, think, I think his hearing. His hearing. I agree. His hearing, yes, that's right. X gets it. All right, Louisa. Eric Roberts. Eric Roberts. Will Butler in Less Than Perfect tonight on ABC, as a matter of fact. Eric, Alfred Nobel of the Nobel Prize fame invented dynamite. Now, that, that's a fact. Nobel was also partially responsible for the inventions of acoustical ceiling tile and trail mix. Now, is that, is that true or false? <laughs> Well, you're leaving out non-fat butter, which he was big on, too. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. I agree. No, we made that up. That's oh. false. <laughs> X, X gets the square, and we're all feeling ashamed. Darren. Norm Crosby for the Norm win. Norm Crosby. For $1,000. In mythology, Norm, when the sun melted Icarus's wings, what happened? Oh, yeah, Icky. I remember that. Uh, what happened was he fell and he landed on his head and he became an associate producer. Uh, uh, actually, he fell. He fell in the ocean and he got wet. I disagree. He, he fell into the ocean and got so wet that he drowned, actually. Yeah, circle. It gets the square there. Louisa? Uh, Diane Cannon. Diane Cannon. Is, Diane, do you have a new, is that a new dog? No, just show? like we change outfits every day. <laughs> so is <her> Man. <laughs> this is Matilda. Oh, okay. Before he married her, Anna Nicole Smith's late husband considered doing this instead. Doing what? <laughs> Having his head examined. <laughs> yeah. No, I think, I think that he considered adopting her. I agree. She's my wife, she's my daughter, she's my wife, she's my daughter. Yeah, that's right. Adopting her, that's right. Circle, who gets the square? Jared. Jeffrey Tambor for the block, please. All right, Jeffrey. <laughs> Ten million fans in 200 countries recently voted that these popular items should now come in purple, not in pink or aqua. What items? Either one of two things. They're either uh, uh, condoms or uh, M&Ms, both of which I use for protection, by the way. <laughs> um, um, I, I think, uh, 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 you know, they do all those research things and, and uh, color uh, uh, research, and uh, I would say M&Ms. I agree. M&Ms it is. Oh, yes, actually. Gets the block. 
Louisa. Martin Mull for the block. Martin Mull for the block. All right, Martin. Because, uh, because he was once the hunter in the family, according to Woman's World, this on a man is 20 times stronger than on a woman. What is it? I'm still trying to figure out why men have nipples. <laughs> uh, but, uh, oh, man. But this is stronger on a man yeah. than it is on a woman? 20 times stronger. I, uh, all right, from hunting. We're talking about hunting. From hunting, we? yeah. So let's just say that the hands, really uh, the hands. I agree. No, just the thumb. Is that, uh, do we have to be that specific? Yes, we do. Yeah, it's just the thumb just for wielding You're supposed to weapon. kill an animal with your yeah, thumb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, Darren. Well, yeah. Martin Bull for the win, please. <laughs> All right. Uh, Martin, Warren Beatty's most memorable pickup line was turned into a song and then a film title. What was it? Uh, it's, um, What's New Pussycat? I disagree. What's new, Pussycat? Ah. Circle gets the block. Ah. We get a break. We'll be right back with more of HQ Hollywood Squares right after this. Stick around. This is the most fun I've ever had in a yellow shirt. And look what I'm sitting next to. The legendary Howie Mandel in the flesh. I, I have dropped the legendary. Did you let that go? You let the legendary go. But there was a thing in the 80s where he was like Michael Jackson and everyone had to call him the legendary. He gradually dropped every word and the, I guess the legendary is now gone too and now it's just Howie. Alright, welcome back. Uh, still slugging through a first thousand dollar game. We'll get right back to that. First, our contestants want to say hi. Darren Cantrell, Mr. X. Tell us about yourself. I am from Visalia, California. I'm a pastor at the Visalia United Methodist Church. I've been married to my great wife, Leslie, for eight years. We have two great kids, Parker and Abigail. All right, good enough. Good to have you here, Darren. And our returning champion, Louisa Abernathy. Remind us about yourself, Louisa. Hi, I'm a temp secretary, born and raised in St. Louis, Missouri. I come from a long line of bakers. I bake myself, and one of my specialties is a triple chocolate cake. Uh-huh. <laughs> You don't have one of those handy, do you? No. All right. Oh, darn it. Louisa, it's your turn. Terry Gar for the win! Terry Gar! For $1,000. Terry, what M word was the original courtesy title for a married woman? M. Uh, I think it would be miserable. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe moronic. I don't know. Uh, for, uh, let's see. I think it was Madame. Madame. I agree. It was Mistress, which gave us the Ooh. abbreviation Mrs. Ooh. Actually, who knew oh X gets God. that one? You're still in this one, Darren. Lindsay Wagner for the win. Lindsay for the win. By the way, I have in my hand here a viewer question. If you'd like to submit a question for us to use on the air, log on to our website HollywoodSquares.com for more information. If we read your question on the air, like I'm about to do for this person, we'll send you one of our nifty T-shirts. This question comes from Mark. Hertchum of New Baltimore, Michigan, watches us on uh, WWJ CBS 62. Here you go, Lindsay. You have six fingers on one hand. Can you find an official bowling ball with six finger holes? I don't have six fingers on one. According to this, you do. <laughs> I do not. Set the record straight. Um, I, uh, no. No. I agree. No, you can't. No. 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 <laughs> X gets the square and the win for $1,000. All right. We're going to play another $1,000 game, and this one has a secret square. Here's what's in the secret square stash today. Turn your photos into works of pop art. PhotoWow.com transforms your favorite photos into large, custom-framed artwork on canvas in 40 design styles, from Warhol-esque multi-panel portraits to double photo montages. Discover more at PhotoWow.com. A gift certificate worth $2,000. Thank you, Jeffrey. Let's show all of you at home who the secret square is. Now you know. Darren, you won the first game. That means you get to start this one. Eric Roberts, please. All right, Eric. In the Lewis Carroll story, what two fat little men agreed to fight a battle after one had spoiled the other's nice new rattle? Everybody knows this. Frickin' frack. 
I agree. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Tweedledee and Tweedledum, actually. Circle gets the square. Louisa. Howie Mandel. Howie Mandel. All right, Howie. Howie, what were, um, or why, rather, were ladies during World War II encouraged to donate their stockings to the war effort? Um, because J. Edgar Hoover didn't like to shop. <laughs> <laughs> So wherever you can get them. I'm Canadian. Was he even... I think that sounds... I know he was a cross-dresser, though, right? Was he not? That was gold. I, I think that they actually, if, if I'm correct, uh, that they, they used the stockings to wrap packages for the soldiers overseas. I disagree. No, to make parachutes. They were turned into parachute fabric. <laughs> Circle gets the square. We get a break. Our secret square game continues on 8 2 Hollywood Squares right after this. After the show, I'm packing because I'm leaving for India in the morning. Just something you do every day after a show, right? <laughs> and there's a big celebration that the Dalai Lama is going to be doing the uh, ceremony in honor of this new stupa. Very exciting. Next week on the show, this is going to be fun. We're doing Game Show Week in our center square, and I'm looking forward to this. We'll be the original host of Hollywood Squares. Peter Marshall will be here as our center square <laughs> next week. It'll be a good time. I think it's going to be a good time for you now, Darren, because it's your turn. Norm Crosby for the block, All right, please. for the block. <laughs> Norm, the first time this annual event took place in 1929, it took Douglas Fairbanks only five minutes to finish the whole thing. What event? <laughs> I believe it was the first Hollywood Christmas parade. All right. I agree. No, the first Academy Awards. Five oh. minutes. Boom, you're in, you're out. Wow. Can't give you that one, Louisa. Norm Crosby for the win. For the win. And a tie game if you get it. In Disney's Snow White, the seven dwarfs whistled while they worked. But what work did they do? Uh, they were dwarfs. <laughs> and they, you know, dwarfs are usually paid uh, under the table. <laughs> they worked in a mine. I agree. They worked in a mine. Yes, that's right. Avatar game, by the way. Lindsay Wagner was our secret square. Nobody picked Lindsay. Tomorrow's secret square will be worth over $9,000. This tiebreaker game's worth over, uh, actually, worse than exactly. $2,000. And, uh, Louisa, you get to start it. Howie Mandel. All right, Howie. Although, although she always carries a pocketbook, it never has money in it. Usually just mints for her horses. Who is this famous matriarch? Uh, I would think it would be Winona Ryder. She doesn't take cash when she goes shopping. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 No, I just... I would say, uh, who carries mints for horses? My wife carries suppositories for ducks, but that makes sense. Uh, <laughs> Laura Bush. Laura Bush. I disagree. Queen Elizabeth. Queen Elizabeth, actually. Circle. <laughs> yes, the square. Darren. Diane Cannon, please. Diane Cannon, all right. Playing for a charity. God's party, Diane Cannon, and you. Diane, let's say your uh, hobby is philography. What do you collect? Guys named Phil. No. Okay. What about, um, oh, you know, when you go to a celebrity, a autograph person, I think that is. I disagree. Autographs. You collect autographs. You know, you disagreed so well, I almost agreed with you. <laughs> and then I have the answer right here. Circle. Yes, <laughs> square, Louisa. Aisha Tyler for the win. All right. Aisha starring in the Santa Claus 2 with Tim Allen out now. Aisha, Dr. Joyce Brothers says that when shown pictures of large and small-breasted women, most men will think the large-breasted ones have less what? Uh, they would think that they had less chances of drowning. <laughs> the answer, 
Uh, the answer is less brains, less intelligence. Less intelligence. I agree. Less intelligence is the assumption. Yes, that's right. Circle gets it. And another $2,000. That distance sound means we are out of time. Darren, we're going to give you $1,000 in our thanks for being here on Thank Hollywood you. Cruise. Thank you, fun. stars. Thank you. But, Louisa, three grand. You're still our champion. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Good for you. All right, now, you know, Louisa won the car yesterday. Today we're playing for a safe full of cash in our bonus round right after this. Stick around. Our champion once again won the car yesterday. New prize now, Louisa. Same start, though. Look over here. We've got nine keys. One of them will open this safe. And in the safe, $25,000 in cash, all right? Okay. So far, we found out a bit about what the stars know. Here's where we find out how much you know about them. You pick a square. I'll read a statement about the star. If you agree or disagree correctly, you get the square at the end of 30 seconds for every square you have gotten correct. We take away a bad key, improving your odds of opening the safe. All right, let's put 30 seconds on the clock. Good luck, Louisa. It starts ticking when you pick your first star. Lindsay Wagner. Lindsay was an all-American gymnast in high school. Agreed. Oh, Wrong. Next. Uh, Howie Mandel. Howie was in a Showtime film called Harris Bergeron. Disagree. Wrong. Next. Uh, Terry Gar. Terry appeared in the original Batman series. Agree. Oh, right. Next. M Martin Mull. Martin began his career as a ventriloquist. Agree. Oh, Wrong. Next. Aisha Tyler. Aisha turned home movies into an award-winning short film. Agree. Oh, Wrong. Next. Eric Roberts. Eric was nominated for an Academy Award. Agree. Oh, right. Next. Jeffrey Tambor. Jeffrey Cohn's Los Angeles bookstore. Agree. Oh, right. Next. Uh, Diane Cannon. Diane was Miss West Seattle. All right. We're out of time. Okay. Let's go count some keys. Okay. Here we go. Harris Bergeron. I don't, I don't want to influence how this works for you, but you did touch the car yesterday. <laughs> All right, okay. You got, you got three right in 30 seconds. We're going to take away three of the bad ones. One of those six will open that safe for $25,000. I'll go with this one. All right, Louise. I can use this money. I can use this money. Good luck. Okay, please. It's not bad enough you can't open it. They do that. <laughs> Let's find out what, what key would have opened it up. Oh, that one over there. Okay. Here's the deal. You got three right. We're going to give you $1,000 for each of those right. correct answers, adding three grand to your total. $6,000 today. And so far, $30,340. We'll start with eight keys tomorrow if you get this far, okay? Louisa will be back. So will Howie Mandel and all our stars. I'm Tom Bergeron. Hope you join us. This is when they say, now we're going to page three, and I fumble for about a half hour trying to find said three. Then this is embarrassing. Watch this. Here's page three, and she, she's very nice. She doesn't say anything like, here's page three, what's wrong with you? Anybody can find page three. She doesn't say that. No, I don't say she's that. She's happy and bright. <laughs> Here we go. The Great Wall! <clears throat> I usually flood the first part. 